Welcome back, friends. Today, we're tackling a crucial decision in the world of construction, choosing the right size compact or MIDI excavator for you and your business. It's not just about big or small, it's about efficiency, power, and getting the job done right. So whether you're a seasoned pro or you just need a machine for your property, you're about to get the full scoop on Sandy's compact line of excavators and see which one might be your perfect match. Let's dig in. Hey guys, I'm Liz. It's the end of the year and that means a, it's cold out here, and B, a lot of folks are trying to decide how to set themselves and their businesses up for success in the new year. With so many makes and models and machines, it's hard enough to decide which brand of excavator to run with. So if you're already decided that you're curious about the Sani, the next decision is which size to buy. Today, we're gonna roll through four of Sani's compact excavator models. The SY60C, the SY75C, the SY80U, and the SY95C. If you're needing something smaller, go ahead and check out our Sani mini excavator comparison video. But for now, let's talk the next size up. Ranging from 13,000 to 20,000 pounds, the machines we're talking about today are the starting sizes of Sani's production excavators. These machines operate versatilely with many different attachment capabilities and larger lift capacities, weights, and flows. One thing to think through with compact machines is whether you want a traditional or conventional tail swing or a reduced or zero tail swing model. Typically, conventional tail swings are known for better balance and stability, while zero tail swings are better fit for tight areas and versatility. But it all depends on the specs of the machines that you're comparing. And that's gonna be helpful looking at our different models here. The machines we're looking at today all come with standard enclosed cabs, heat, AC, a full LED lighting package, and an up and down dozer blade. Plus, because they're all under 74 horsepower, no def is required in any of these four machines. But best of all is that Sani offers the industry leading five year, 5,000 hour warranty to back up each of them. Bumper to bumper, minus wear and tear and ground engaging parts, this warranty covers the machine for the long haul. Every machine needs maintenance and sometimes even repair work during its lifetime. That's why in the end, having a strong warranty, trust in your service provider, and reliable parts availability is what's gonna get you through. Now that we've taken a look at the overall scope of these machines, let's dive a little deeper into each one. First up for you all is our Sani SY60C. If you watched our mini excavator comparison video, you got a taste of this guy already. The Sani SY60 is sometimes considered a mini excavator, even though it's considered by Sani as the smallest production machine in their lineup. Equipped with a swing boom and a conventional tail swing radius, this excavator can still fit in tight areas, although you do have to be a little bit more careful about your back end compared to the zero tail swing minis. Weighing 13,500 pounds with a 55 horsepower Isuzu engine, it packs the power and flow needed for excavation, land clearing, forestry work, and even some light demolition. With over 10,000 foot-pounds of breakout force, almost 9,000 pound lift capacity, 21 foot reach, and 13 foot dig depth, it's similar to the John Deere 60G, the Bobcat E63, and the Case CX75C. The SY60C is a great choice for those who work in smaller areas but need more reach, power, and lift capacity than a mini excavator could provide. We've had a lot of contractors buy the SY60C with tilt buckets to dig things like in-ground pools. We've had other customers buy brush cutters or bush hogs to mow along lakes and streams, which is extra useful with that swing boom. We've had still other customers in land clearing applications with high inertia and forestry mulchers to clear brush and trees. You can run a manual or a hydraulic quick coupler on this machine, as well as hammers, augers, and up to a 48 inch bucket, making this an extra versatile option if you're needing more of a multi-tool for your projects. We have a few SY60Cs working at a very large magical theme park you probably know of, doing underground utility applications with plumbing and draining pipe solutions. And of course, with Sani's standard five year, 5,000 hour warranty, your 60 will deliver max value for your jobs. Next up is the Sani SY75C. 
Some people consider this machine an in-between machine because it splits the difference between the 60 and the 80. The 75 weighs just over 16,000 pounds and runs a Yanmar 57 horsepower engine. It has almost 12,000 foot-pounds of breakout force, over 9,000 pounds of lift capacity, a max reach of 21 feet, and a dig depth of 14 feet and 7 inches. And because it acts like more of an in-between machine, the SY75C is also comparable to the Bobcat E63, the Deer 60G, and the Case CX75C, just like the Sani 60. The 75 has a conventional tail swing and a fixed boom, which offer stability that can be especially helpful when you're running things like heavier hydraulic attachments. And speaking of attachments, the 75 is pre-plumbed with one and two-way primary auxiliary hydraulics, plus two-way secondary auxiliary circuits as well. Put your thumb on low flow and your mulcher on high flow, and you're ready to run. The SY75C is great for things like land clearing work, underground utilities, septic installation, trenching, digging electrical lines, and a lot more. While the SY75C comes standard with rubber tracks, you also have the option for steel tracks. That can be nice if you're going to be in more rough terrain or you don't need protection for surfaces like finished asphalt or concrete. Plus, if you're extra techy, the 75 comes standard with an advanced touchscreen display in the cab where you can control your Bluetooth radio and watch your rear view camera. And on top of all of that, it comes keyless with a push to start button and is extremely comfortable in the cab. But if the 75 just isn't your thing, our next option is the SY80. The Sani SY80U is a machine in high demand. This is a great intermediate size excavator for mid and large contractors because it has all the features of a smaller machine like your swing boom, belted rubber tracks, and reduced tail swing, but also those more powerful features of the large machines like your greater dig depth, dump height, and breakout force. Like the SY75C, the SY80U has the option for steel tracks too if you prefer that over rubber. With its swing boom and reduced tail swing, even at 19,400 pounds, it can still maneuver in tighter areas and access those hard to reach places. The 80 has a 66.4 horsepower Yanmar engine with over 16,300 foot-pounds of breakout force and an almost 15 foot dig depth. With nearly 13,500 pounds of lift capacity, the SY80U is definitely not lacking in power. Plus, like the 75, it has both one and two-way primary hydraulics and two-way secondary hydraulics. So you're pre-plumbed to run just about anything off the end of the stick. Typically, you'll find 10-ton machines in heavy digging and demolition applications. And with an almost 24-foot reach, this is a great machine for loading trucks and moving earth. Similar to the Cat 308, the John Deere 85G, and the Bobcat E85, it can serve a variety of needs on small and large development jobs. And of course, it's also great for things like trenching, septic installation, utility work, some pipe laying and digging foundations as well. Those rubber tracks, swing boom, and reduced tail swing make this powerful machine a great option for those in need of a variety of different applications. Last but not least in today's compact excavator comparison is the Sani SY95C. The 95 is another in-between excavator weighing over 20,200 pounds with a 66.4 horsepower Yanmar engine. This is a conventional style excavator with the counterweight extending over the back for added stability. It also has a fixed boom like the Sani SY75C, which provides straightforward vertical digging without the added lateral swing. If your primary tasks are gonna involve lifting heavy loads or materials, some people might prefer a fixed boom for added stability during those lifting operations. Unlike the other machines in this video, the SY95 comes standard with steel tracks. While rubber tracks are awesome on finished landscaping and pavement, steel tracks gain a traction advantage in harsher terrains and environments. You'll also likely see an increase in stability and durability in steel tracks over rubber tracks with a longer track life. The SY95C has a 14,300 foot-pound breakout force and a 12,800 pound lift capacity with an almost 22 foot reach and a 14 foot two inch dig depth. Due to its size, the SY95C is the first machine in the lineup that loses the option for the manual quick coupler. You'll definitely want a hydraulic one in order to easily swap between attachments without having to remove the pin. 
It is plumbed with one and two way primary auxiliary hydraulics and can run a range of attachments. Like the 80, you're gonna be well suited for land clearing, demolition, digging foundations, trenching, and loading trucks with the 95. We actually even have a customer using a 95 for boat salvaging when they end up shipwrecked off the coast of Florida. He takes them from the beaches, brings them to his wrecking yard, and recycles the scraps afterwards. When it comes to choosing between an SY80U and the SY95C, it really comes down to personal preference and what's going to be the most useful for your job sites. All right, friends, that wraps up our in-depth exploration of Sani's compact excavator lineup. Maybe you're gearing up for the new year, refreshing your fleet. Or maybe you're trying to decide which size to rent for a big project you have coming up. Maybe business was really good this year and you want to take advantage of the Section 179 tax deduction. Or maybe you're investing in equipment for your personal property or farmland. Regardless of the reason, we've covered the essential details on four key SANI models. The versatile SY60C, the more in-between SY75C, the high demand SY80U, and the more robust SY95C. Of course, when you're picking a compact excavator, your biggest concerns probably come down to things like spec needs, unique features, transportation, budget constraints, and personal preference. As always, if you're interested in checking out any of these machines for yourself, you are always welcome here at Newman Tractor. Stop in at any of our locations, check us out online, or give us a call to talk through financing, availability, or how you can get a hold of one of these machines today. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.